So I believe the Kingdom of Cybertron is the same piece because this is a leader class. So when I'm looking at it and taking it out of the box, I think it is the same looking at the details of the piece here. So, and you can see the, the barrel blaster is like the same size, but the quality is unremarkable. It is just amazing. Like, cause you could tell it's the same guy, you know? The detail is just uncanny. It's like basically a masterpiece. Like, cause I have, I mean, obviously the packaging is different. Cause if you look here, you know, you could see that uh, the packaging is legacy. It does say Galvatron, but it is leader, leader class. So, so when I take this bad boy and I transform, it's about 33 steps um, looking at it. It does come with the matrix of leadership, as you can see down here. So right there is the matrix of leadership. When I paid for this um, copyrighted Sovereign, I mean, it's like over 200 something after market. But now with Hasbro releasing this guy, um, aftermarket value is, is quite much. So if you could find him, it's kind of hard to get, but excellent. I mean, when he became Galvatron, he was like way more ruthless than Megatron. Like Megatron was, you know, pretty goofy and stuff. Like Megatron, you know, the masterpiece. Um, he was goofy, but when he became Galvatron, he was like, like you didn't want to mess with him. He was one badass SOB, like literally my favorite character and I, I had to pull the trigger on this guy. I mean the instruction manual looks even amazing. Look at that thing. The artwork. 33 steps. Such a magnificent toy. The detail on this thing is unbelievable. I mean once you get the matrix of leadership and you put the barrel on and um, you attach you know the the shooting cannons parts on the back for that because normally you put the barrel on here that once he turns into the uh, cannon mode um, but I think it looks absolutely amazing in robot mode and it's pretty huge because he's naturally not a, as big and tall but considering it is a leader you could tell by the way the joints move and everything that it's quality as far as see there's a lot of articulation these twists they go back and up um, and here's from the backside here so you can see like in this can and how nice it looks and you know we're gonna transform I mean 33 steps is pretty good he stands pretty good too considering you know you could you could pop these suckers out in and out and um and do that what so forth so that would be cool so you could also combine the things that were like on his back that you saw to make like a gun too which is pretty cool see so it's like a double gun or like a big um pistol style gun all right and like 10 minutes later that's the full transformation right there it's pretty awesome because once you get the bottom part set up there actually are little wheels as you can see the wheels right there and on the bottom of the the tank like arms of his legs he could roll so you could like roll it like that and then um when you detach this part from the the barrel cannon then it plugs right in and then those the gun you separate the gun and you put one on each side so you put one here and you also put one here which is pretty dang cool but uh yeah that's kind of galvatron guys and uh it's an amazing piece um one of the rarest um pieces and that's why i needed both versions for for what it is you know so and you connect like the matrix of leadership in the front right there. See how it's like on his like kind of chest there. So which is pretty dang cool. But, uh, that's the cannon mode, and then uh, earlier you guys seen the robot mode.